Hi, in this video we're going to show you a free file conversion tool you could use on your computer. And once you install it, it'll actually give you a right-click uh, context menu selection there. So this will work with various types of files such as uh, PDFs, documents, videos, uh, music, photos, that type of thing. So once you install it, you just need to pick your file. So let's say we have a Word document here. And if you right-click, you'll have this file converter option here. And then you could pick your options. So this, for Word documents, either have PDF or PNG. So if we say P PDF here, it'll go through the process here. And then it'll close itself when it's done. So now we have the PDF file here, just like that. And let's say we want to do a photo. Here's our options here from GIF, PNG, WebP, uh, different PNGs, JPEG, icon file, PDF like so. And same for bitmap, you'll have similar options. Or actually the same options as just an image. So let's say we want to change this bitmap to a JPEG. Click the JPEG option here. So that was quick since it's just a photo. So now here's the original bitmap. And here's the photo, or the JPEG version, like that. So it looks pretty good. Uh, PDFs, you only have to a PNG file, so it'll actually break apart each page and make a separate PNG file out of it. It'll be a transparent PNG, too. It's kind of an odd choice. You would think you'd want like a JPEG or something, you know, not transparent. But that's an option you have there. Uh, for music, you can do one of these files, OGG, WAV, AAC. And there's also, you'll notice, too, when you choose this, you can configure the presets. So if you want to change some of the quality settings, for the different uh, types of files here. You could come in here and do that. And then same for videos. Let's say we're going to take this MP4 to an AVI, for example. This one will take a little longer since it's a bigger file. So here's our original MP4. And here's the AVI version. Looks pretty much the same there. So there's just a quick overview how it works. So like I said, once you install it, you just right click on the file type. And if it's a non-supported file type, like this one, for example, you'll see you don't even have the option. So if you don't have the uh, file converter option, then it's not something that's supported for a conversion. Okay, so I'll put a link in the description where you could download it, and like I said, it's free, and then you could uh, try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.